As we venture into the new year here on the Armour All Summer Grill, why don't we take a closer look at the supercars calendar for season 2019. Probably the things to note, of course, is that Sydney Motorsport Park, which was an award-winning event under lights in 2018, is gone this year, likely to make a return under a potential summer series format in 2020. And let's talk about the Pertec Enduro Cup here, because that's probably the key difference in the, the calendar here in the in the shuffle we're going to start with Bathurst yeah it's a big game changer so it puts a lot more emphasis on the guys that are doing super two and maybe even super three now and lounge as you said in the earlier and I mean, and that makes it lounge, but you, you're coming off the bench and you're straight into Bathurst so. perfect guy to have yeah. yeah so the super cheap auto 1000 is what we kick off uh, the Enduro Cup with. Sandown's kind of at the back end now. It's, it's got a different vibe about it, doesn't it? It has a different vibe. And traditionally, you'll see co-drivers make mistakes. The guys that aren't driving all year will make a few silly mistakes at Sandown, especially in those co-driver races. Get themselves, oh, out. Yeah. get themselves back up to speed. Friday, by Saturday afternoon, they're pretty comfortable in the car and they're, they're back up to speed again. They don't have time to play themselves in anymore. So... You, this could be the thing that gets more and more young guys into the sport. The guys doing Super 2 might get an opportunity. Big emphasis on the, on the Super 2 Championship. Still lots to be discussed in terms of the potential move to a, a summer series. When would it have a, if would it have a mid-season break and so on. Let's just talk largely about the notion of summer racing. You know, going kind of head to head with cricket and maybe a, a formula that's faster paced. Do you like the sound of that? Yeah, I think it's really about television, isn't it? They've, they've got to get themselves in a space where they haven't got competition from the, from the ball sports, the, the footballs, the AFL and the NRL. So there's a bit of free space there and that's what they've got to try and get into. With some underlights races and things like that, it would work over summer, wouldn't it? Yeah, it'll work. It works for Speedway. It works in New Zealand. They always race over summer. Yep. Purists might say they miss you know, the, the um, you know, certain races at, at the time slots in the year that we're so used to them. Would you, would you, you know, subscribe to that or not really? Yeah, well, I would if they kept them in the time slots so used to them. But, you know, the calendar's moved around so much that people have forgotten when they're on anyway. So they've already messed with that formula and people have lost. They don't know when it's on. It's not on free-to-air TV. It's only on Fox. Most of the people have disconnected with it, rebrand it, regroup it and get it going. Yes or no, summer series? Yes, definitely okay. yes. That's the vote from Paul Morris. You heard it here first. Armour All Summer Grill will be back with more here at speedcafe.com real soon. Each week, Armour All will be giving away the ultimate summer essentials pack. The kit comprises a range of products to keep your car looking new, including the latest Armour All wash and wax, two-in-one wash mitt, a drying towel, protectant, cleaning wipes, glass cleaner and an air freshener. Watch the Armour All Summer Grill episodes on speedcafe.com to find out how to enter. So Armour All make a great range of car washing products. And of course you've got your standard car wash. Or you've got your heavy duty car washes if there's a bit more grit and grime around, four wheel driving, or you're like me and have a farm mute with lots of insects on the front of it. Now wash and wax won't remove the need to wax your car, but whilst cleaning it leaves a fine film of canuba wax across the car to look after the shine and sheen over time. The next generation of washers is Armour All Wash and Wax Pro Glide. Hate it when your car gets water spots all over it? Well this one is fantastic. It not only cleans and shines, but has polymers that protect the car against those water spots and marks. So let me give you a couple of simple but top tips when washing your car. Number one, use two sponges. And one of those, keep it for just doing the wheels, the tyres and around under the mud flaps so you don't end up dragging all that horrible grit and brake dust up onto your painted surfaces or your glass. And the other one, get out of the sun, wash your car in the shade, always. It's a no-brainer.